Hi, this is Steve. Welcome back to Scale Model Kit Review. In this video, I continue to build the Eagle Moss Gone in 60 Seconds Eleanor. I am on pack number 7. In pack number 7, I complete stages 23 through 26. I work on one of the seats, the chassis, and the rear axle. Um, I'd like to thank everybody who subscribes to my channel and who has supported my channel up to now and I appreciate everybody here who uh, does subscribe to my channel. If you're new to my channel just reach down there and hit the subscribe button and give me a thumbs up. It means a lot to me and it really helps get the word out that I'm out there uh, building these part work kits and, and so. So without further ado let's get started. Welcome back to pack 7 and this is the Gone in 60 Seconds Eleanor from Eagle Moss Diecast Club. And for pack 7 we will be assembling stages 23 through 26. The right seat bottom and cushion, the rear chassis middle part 1, the rear chassis middle part 2, and the rear axle and differential housing covers. Let's look at the magazine itself. Leading Lady here is the first article for beautiful Eleanor. And then they give us another wonderful shot of the car. And Gone in 60 Seconds Universe, Otto Memphis Mentor. Continuing on with that, and on the right side there we have uh, the 60 Seconds Files, Go Behind the Scenes, original movie, the Mandarin pace in the original blackboard and then continuing on with the women named cars cars with women's name Lynn 1998 Toyota Supra Turbo and Sharon a 1965 Pontiac GTO and the last thing classic Mustangs a rare T5, a Mustang in disguise. And a preview of what we got coming up in uh, pack number eight. Let's get started. Welcome back. Let's look at the build instructions for stage 23. And for stage 23, we're going to start assembling the right seat bottom and cushion. And I apologize for my air conditioner. I live in Tucson. It's very hot outside. Here's all the parts we received for that. And we start assembling the seat bottom. We're going to mate that to the seat back. And we're going to put in our two screws in this part of the stage. And two more screws in the other part of the stage. And that completes. Let's get started. Here's the parts pack for stage 23. This happens to be the seat bottom. Let me take this out and I'll be right back. Here's all the parts for stage 23 and seat bottom frame itself made of plastic. Seat bottom cushion already has the chrome piece uh, put on there already. It looks very nice, very cushiony. And PS05 screws. All right, first thing we're gonna do with this is we're gonna bring over the seat back and we're gonna mate that to the seat bottom, just like that. And then we're gonna take the seat top, we're gonna to put that right on top there. And that should just snap down in place. Just like that. PSO5 screws go into this, four of them. there. Great looking seat. And that completes stage 23. Let's go to stage 24. Mm -hmm. 
Welcome back. Let's look at the build instructions for stage 24. So for stage 24, we assemble the chassis rear middle part one. And these are the parts we received with that. Simply put that on the rear uh, chassis that we received in the previous stage. We start putting in DSO2 screws, two of them in those stages there, and two more in those stages right there, and then we're complete. So let's get started. Here's the parts pack for stage 24, and it's pretty heavy, so that must mean it's made of metal. Let me take this out, and I'll be right back. And here's a close-up of the part, and it is made of metal. Satin finish on there, very nice. And the screws we received are the DSO2 screws. All right, so we're gonna mate that part up to the back of the car. And you wanna basically have it match. The underside matches this underside. And it's gonna go into these four holes, just like that. And we're gonna put screws down. But before I do that, I'm gonna go ahead and lubricate those screw points with my Vaseline. Next, I'm going to go ahead and uh, make that up to that. Turn this over. DSO2 screws go into this. And the last one. And it looks great. And that's all we do for stage 24. Let's go to stage 25. Welcome back. Let's look at the build instructions for stage 25. So for stage 25, we're going to install the rear middle part, part 2. And this is the parts that we received. And we're simply going to insert that down on the, the chassis. We're going to install DSO2 screws into this. We're going to install two there, right here, and then two more further back. And two more on the further back side. Two more there. One more here. And that completes it. So let's get started. Here's our pack of parts for stage 25. I'll go ahead and take this out and we'll get a closer look. And here's a close up of that part. This is made of plastic here. That's our drive shaft tunnel, transmission tunnel, and DSO2 screws. And we're going to go ahead and install this part here onto our chassis and it's simply just going to insert over the top just like that and we're putting screws in the metal once again so I need to lubricate those screw holes so we need to do three up front here there we go I'll go ahead and put this down once again it should just snap down which it does DSO2 screws go into this. And the last screw, number nine. And they were all DS2, DSO2 screws. There we go. Fully installed. That's all we do for stage 25. Let's go to stage 26. Welcome back. Let's get to build instructions for stage 26, which is the final stage for pack 7. So for stage 26, we're going to assemble the rear axle and differential housing cover. Here's the parts we received with that. We're going to put a couple of screws, the PS08 screws, into the rear diff cover. 
and that's all we do. Let me get the parts and I'll be right back. Here's the parts pack for stage 26. And if you'll give me a minute, I'll take this out. We'll get a closer look. And here's a close-up of those parts. This is the rear axle one, as they call it. And this is made of ABS plastic. Also the differential housing cover itself, which is also made of plastic. And PS08 screws. Not much to do here, but we're going to do a little bit of a step here. We're going to put in our PS08 screws into the back of the differential cover. And last one here. And that's perfect. So eventually this is going to get mounted into the differential cover like that as example and hold it in place. But we don't do that now. So, and that's all I do for stage 26. This is the final stage for pack 7. I'll be right back. So that completes uh, pack 7 of the Eleanor Gone in 60 Seconds build. And uh, this is a fantastic build. It's very similar to the uh, GT500 build that I am currently doing. And I'm almost finished with, by the way. And, uh, of course, we installed the gas tank here and installed one of the body panels onto the lower back chassis. Uh, we're starting on the rear axle. And, of course, one of, the, one of the seats here, I believe it's the driver's seat. So... I highly recommend this kit to you. It's a part work kit, and when it becomes available, I highly suggest you uh, get it for yourself. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. Please subscribe to my channel and hit the bell for all video upload notifications. I highly recommend this kit. It's a fabulous part work kit, so when it does become available, I highly recommend it. So, happy modeling, everybody, and take care.